Padilla is ready to work to Liao Yuan Shu, the shortstop for Chinese Taipei. And away we go. The eighth pitch struck him out. Boy, if that battle is any indicator, it's going to be a fun six innings. The 11th pitch into center field base hit. You cannot have two ABs that are more workmanlike to start a game. The 24th pitch of the inning. He's cut on and miss. Couple of Ks for Miguel Padilla in the first. What a great venue this is as well. This one goes past Garcia, and Seng Yi Sa moves up 60 feet into scoring position with two outs. Man at second, here comes the 2-1. On a line into left field, that's a base hit, and it'll score a run. Chinese Taipei strikes first on a bullet from Wang Yuan Fu. And credit Wang Yuan Fu for staying back on an off-speed pitch. Padilla tries to go to the slider in this situation, just leaves it up a little bit too much. And Wang Yuan Fu deposits that thing hard in the left field. We see a little bit of a misplay out there from Carol Barubis. And Asia Pacific takes advantage, and we see the celebrations. The 30th pitch is a strike. Runner takes off Garcia's throw. Does not get Wang Yuan Fu. 0-2 pitch. Bullet to second and snared by Yvonne Cuesta. On the ground to his middle infield partner. And Liao Yuan Shu throws out Jesus Gomez. Ooh. Happy it hit the bat, and now Padilla bounces one up the middle into center field of base hit. The superstar for Mexico is on with a one-out single here in the first. How you want things to line up to give yourself the best chance to win it all. Zarate gets hit, and back-to-back -back Mexico hitters have reached with one out here in the first. The 1-1 from Wang Yuan Fu is slapped in the air to right center field, and that to the wall. Padilla scores. They stop Zarate at third, and this game is tied in the first. And this is what we saw a lot of with Mexico so far at this Little League World Series is their ability to drive the baseball the other way. This is a slider left up and in the zone, and Mireles does a great job of just going the other way with it, but with some authority. I think it was a very smart move to hold up David Zarate over there at third base. He's running a little bit gingerly after, be get, after getting hit in the leg. 3-2. Jimenez strikes out. Boy, that is a big punch out for Wang Yuan Fu for out number two. But he didn't see it at all. 1-2. Strike three calls. Oh. No. <laughs> it looked like he said, oh. yes, it is. What do we got? A strikeout in. <laughs> we had it all the way. You had it right. Padilla's 0 2. Up and in. Gonna be hard to touch a fastball like that, X. Adorned with autographs. A 3 2 just misses. And the piano playing lefty is on with one out in the second. 0 2. On the ground, right side, long way to go, and through into right. Past Ivan Cuesta. Two on. He needs two days rest. On the ground, right side, Cuesta charges and gets out number two. Two in scoring position. Did Williamsport. Pitch 50 is grounded to short. Oh. Jimenez on the back. Oh. What a throw! Oh. Inning over. Now, this ball was scalded, first and foremost, hit hard off the barrel. But I think the best thing that happens is Jimenez gets a hop right here that allows him to gain ground with his right foot. Uh. Hit hard left field base hit. Fernando Garcia is fist pumping mere moments after coming out of the box. He's fired up. 3-2. Struck him out. Wang Yuan Fu's third K is the first out in the second. One, two. On the edge, strike three calls. That is a punch out. 
Wang Yuan Fu case two after the leadoff single from Mexico in the second. Floated behind third. That's a fair ball, and it spins down the line. Second hit for Seng Yi Su, the Chinese Taipei catcher, and a leadoff knock in the third. 2-2 two -two. to second. Cuesta turns. Jimenez is throw. Goes wide. Now they've got the runner hung up between first and second. They run at Chen Li Chen. Chase him back to first, and Padilla slaps the tag on him. It's a double play. Really, really good heads up defensive play there. Well, after that, the 3 2 is bounce left side. Jimenez in the hole again. We've already seen that. 2 3 and 4 for Mexico. Miguel Padilla takes ball four from Wang Yuan Fu. 1 2. Strike three calls. Another backwards K for Wang Yuan Fu, and there's one down. 2 2. A strikeout for Xiao Zhao Chun. Two down. Waiting on the 1 2. Good breaking ball from Xiao Zhao Chun. And three strikeouts spread among two pitchers. Three days rest. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Lee Fang Mo gets hit by the pitch. <laughs> or did he? Hey, the umpire is signaling you were hit by a pitch. And third base coach is saying, go to first. But Mexico is not going to challenge. And now Lee Fang Mo moves up 60 feet. And the throw gets away into left center field. Oh! He's at third when he very well might not be even on the base pads. So a questionable hit by pitch, a stolen base, and an errant throw, and they have a guy at third with nobody out. He's in a tricky spot here. 2-2. Two -two. Struck him out. One away for David Zarate. 3-2 on the way. Bouncing ball toward first. Runner to the plate. The throw. They have Lee Fang Mo hung up. And the throw hits off him. He scores and Chinese Taipei leads. Yeah, Tim, this is a tough one because Gomez did the right job, right? He saw, got the soft ground ball, was able to make the throw home to Garcia, the catcher. But once this play was made home to Garcia, Garcia real, should have realized he had a little bit more time. Also understand the runner is on is on the fair territory side of the foul line. One, two. Zarate with his second strikeout. No, is that, is that a rule or what? No, no. To the backstop. Pai Chang Yen to third. 3-1 is high. Five pitch walk to the pitch hitter Chen Po Chun. Already had a two hit game here against Italy. Smashed. Center field on the run and off the wall. Second baseman Mireles is going, gonna go out to this ball. He's look at third first. He's lined up for third, then realizes the runner at third is coming home to cut down another run. This is the textbook cutoff play. Watch this. The center fielder. Gets the ball off the wall and throws a strike to the second baseman. Watch this throw home. 0-2 oh, on the edge. Four batters face, three strikeouts for Sha Zhao Shun. Says he loves them because of the cops and the 3,000 hits. And Castillo's got his second knock here at the Little League World Series. He is the third youngest player of the 20 teams here, and he is an on-base machine. Bouncing ball, first pitch swinging from Juan Pablo Puente, and they get the force on Castillo at second. Some hard contact from some pinch hitters for Mexico. First pitch swinging, and Shen Li Chen one hops it to second and reaches. 2-2 pitch from Covarrubias is strike three calls. Two down. One-two pitch and a strikeout. Back-to-back -back K's for Marco Covarrubias. 
Three balls, two strikes. The pitch on the ground towards short. Top play. Yuan Chu spins. Doesn't get it there in time. Padilla is on. The tying run comes to the plate for Mexico in the form of David Zarate. 3-1. Tying run aboard. Check swing. In the air, right field at Pai Cheng Yen, who makes the catch. And no movement knowing he's got that arm. Hit hard, but for out number two. One, two. Struck him out. Sha Zhao Shun has been fabulous in relief. 0-2 oh, from Marco Covarrubias is popped into short right. Top play going out. Oh! No, on a bounce, they say. Despite the best efforts from David Zarate, who disagrees. Let's hear about being one of the last four teams to be playing. You win this game, you're one of the final four. That is crazy. Good bunt by Yi Chen to first, and the throw to first. Hernan Mireles covering the throw from Jesus Gomez for the first down. Second and third, one-on-one -on -one pitch. Bouncing ball towards short. Jimenez throws to the plate. Garcia gets the tag on him. They might argue he was blocking the plate. Either way, nice job, Jimenez, coming up on this baseball, getting to it quick and firing a strike to home plate. Here's another look. Tim, I, I don't know if there was a lane. Well, there is definitely not a lane. Again, the problem with that is he moves to the ball that takes him to that spot on the plate. What else is he supposed to do? That's why I have a little problem with the change of the rule. I understand we're trying to keep our catchers healthy, but when the throw takes you there, what are you supposed to do? Here's the letter of the law. Obstruction can be called on a player who blocks off a base, including home plate from a runner, while not in possession of the ball. We have obstruction here, score the run. You heard what they're doing. They're calling exactly that. And thank you, Mike. Obstruction is when you obstruct a runner. Interference is when you interfere with a fielder. Now you can say the throw took him there, but you can also he, he say he's set up there first. That, that, you're right. That is the correct call. And the RBI double is last time. And now rolls this one off the end of the bat. Gomez to the back, goes to second, the tag. No. Wu Xuan Hung got out of the way and is safe at second, or rather, Xi Yi Hung. The runner from third may have crossed home plate first anyway. Bouncing ball to second. Morella stabs, inning over, two runs for Chinese Taipei, who is three outs away, up by four. 2-2. Two -two. Bouncing ball off the glove. Xiao Zhao Xun picks it up, flips, and there's one away. A strikeout for Li Fang Mo and Chinese Taipei. He's one out away. Li Fang Mo's 1 1. In the air, right field coming on. It's Xiao Hoon, and it gets past him. Kovarubius to second. Pai Cheng Yen's throw! Safe. Does the tag stay on long enough when that foot comes off of the bag? So right foot up, left foot tagged, ball game. Chinese Taipei is 3-0, and and they're in the international championship game on Saturday. And another dominant pitching performance by Chinese Taipei in this Little League World Series. They've allowed one run.